<laughs> oh man. <laughs> it looks so pretty. Thank you. Love you. Love you. Oh man. Not what I thought the dress was gonna look like, <laughs> but kind of similar. <laughs> Chaslin, today has finally come that we both have dreamed about for many years. There's not many words that can actually describe the way I'm actually feeling in this mo moment. Grateful. Grateful that you, can come, you came into my life and showed me what true love actually meant. Your love is deep and like no other. From the very first conversation we had seven years ago, I knew my life would change from that day forward. <sighs> Standing in the rain, always loving you. <laughs> it never changed. It's raining right now. <laughs> raining right now. <laughs> Selflessness. You're always putting me first and made sure I was always beyond happy. Thank you for always showing me the light at the end of the tunnel, no matter how dark or bright it actually was. Thank you for always fighting for us and never giving up, even when things get tough. Thank you. <sighs> oh. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> I vow to always love you unconditionally, no matter what life throws at us. I know things will get tough one day, but knowing that I have you standing next to me makes them not seem so bad. I can't wait to make you the happiest ride today, a wife tomorrow, and one day a future mother. <sighs> this family will always grow, will get to grow and get to see what I feel and felt for many, many years now. I can't wait to share it with you and them with you. That's the future, the end game. But right now in the present, all I want to do is hold you for forever and kiss you to, or, and kiss you so, so much. I promise to provide and lead the family the only way I know how, always putting you first, never second, always beside your side, never front or behind you. That's what ke queens belong on top. See you soon, Mrs. Stanley. I can't wait to see your beautiful self straight coming straight home to me. Aww. <laughs> that was so sweet. I love you. Mm. I'm sorry, the number was really uh. on the way. <laughs> Michael, as we take this next step in our future, I just want you to know how much I love you and how much you mean to me. I'll always be your best friend and life partner, and that will always be my most important vow to you. I promise I will never go to bed angry when it seems like we just got into like one of the biggest arguments because we absolutely can get through any trial and tribulation that is thrown our way. I promise to always be your biggest cheerleader. You make me the proudest partner because you're always pushing yourself and doing everything you can not only to better yourself, but better us as well. I promise to give you the remote on Sundays and watch NFL on Mondays in the fall, just so we can keep up with the Chiefs, of course, though. I promise to be your home and to hold your heart close to mine. You have my unwavering trust and care, and I'll always put you in our relationship first. I vow to truly love you, love you so deeply that it hurts. I've never smiled so big or loved so hard and cared so deeply for someone in my entire life. And you're truly my soulmate. <laughs> And you complete me. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> sorry. You are my whole world. And I cannot wait for this beautiful life that we get to build together. If there are any things to be true, I vow to respect you and to honor you and to always be honest with you. I will celebrate your successes and stand by you and your failures. Together we'll build a home filled with laughter, love, and understanding. And as we embark on this journey together, I promise to love you more with each passing day. I love you to the moon and back a million times, Michael Stanley, and I cannot wait to be your wife. <laughs> I love you. Love you. It's fine. We're gonna. We're just gonna do it with rain. Yeah. I have makeup going absolutely everywhere.
Michael and Chastlin, may your home be a haven of peace. May your relationship be one of truth and understanding. May you enjoy length of days and fulfillment of hopes and peace and contentment as you day by day live and fulfill the terms of the covenant that you have made with one another today. And so as it is today, as you, Michael and Chastlin, have pledged your vows, and you've consented to wed each other, and you've consecrated the celebration by the giving and the receiving of rings, by virtue of the authority that has been vested in me under the laws of our beautiful state of Tennessee. It is a great, great privilege to pronounce that you are now husband and wife. Michael, you may kiss the bride. Chaslin, um, ever since we were younger, you've always been the one who's danced in the storm in your best dress, and today you're absolutely glowing. When you met Michael, it, everything had changed for the better. I love you with all my heart, and I'm so glad you and Michael found each other. Um, y'all are two peas in a pod made for each other, and I couldn't be happier for you guys and y'all's love and everything. The hole in his life and mine was a void. I couldn't ask for a better person than Chaslin to step into my shoes because there's no one on this planet than that man right there that means anything more than me and I know it's reciprocated. I knew from the second I held you, the bond between, between us would unlike anything I could have imagined. I have no doubt you are going to be an amazing wife. And so I just appreciate you taking care of my brother the way I would and uh, giving him a home and eventually a family. Michael, she has been mine for the last 27 years, but it's now time to let go. So please, Take care of my baby girl. May your love be daylight always, beautiful and bright, and may your love story never go out of style. Cheers. <laughs>